Investment Basics What does investing mean to you? At its most basic level, investing is a simply a way to manage your money to help yourself achieve your financial goals. To decide how to invest your money, the first question to ask yourself is, what are you investing for? Retirement, a child's education, or short-term goals, like a home down payment, a car, or an emergency fund. Investment planning doesn't have to be difficult, but there are four key concepts you need to think about. Diversification, balance, your personal situation, and the value of time. Diversification is one way to help manage your risk. Because different investments may respond differently to changing conditions, diversification can help you even out your portfolio's ups and downs. And although diversification alone can ensure a profit or protect against a loss, spreading your money over several types of investments can help reduce your risk of losing your entire nest egg. When planning how many eggs to put in each basket, you'll need to think about three possible goals for your investments. Growth investments have the most potential to appreciate in value over the long term. Income investments offer regular payments of income. Still other investments won't increase much in value, but are the least likely to lose money and can easily be converted into cash. If you're planning a major purchase soon and want to make sure that money is there when you need it, stability might be your primary goal for the money. Many investors focus on growth-oriented investments like stocks for money they don't expect to need for a long time. And investments such as bonds can provide income through regular ongoing interest payments. Most investors like to combine all three. They're probably your best way to maximize your overall return without taking more risk than you're comfortable with is to have the right balance between stability, income, and growth. That balance is known as your asset allocation. How you determine it will largely depend on two factors your time horizon for your various financial goals, and also your financial and emotional ability to tolerate risk. You can't completely avoid risk when it comes to investing, but balancing stability, income, and growth can help you manage it. Let time help you build your savings. Someone who invests $3,000 every year beginning at age 20 and gets a 6% annual after-tax rate return would accumulate almost $680,000 by age 66. Wait until 45, to start saving $3,000 each year at the same rate of return and the amount accumulated by age 66 would only be about $120,000. In the end, you'll want to put in place an investment plan that's diversified, balanced, and suits your individual needs and risk tolerance. Don't put off investment decisions that can help you achieve your financial goals. Ask questions and start planning now. If you have questions, please call our Member Service Center at one 800 991 2221